In 1985, the world got its first opportunity to wear the same sneakers as a basketball legend. Man was not meant to fly. Air Jordan. I was a 10-year-old kid growing up in Philadelphia, and when Jordan, you know, Michael Jordan became a star, and Jordans first came out. Brian Dean's original black, red, and white Nike Air Jordan is on display inside his sneaker boutique. John's on fire. And I loved wearing them. I wore them for a year and a half until I had two holes in the bottom and my toes were crawling under. I didn't know it at the time, but that was the beginning of, call it sneaker culture. A culture that has turned the sneaker market into a multi-billion dollar industry, expected to reach $30 billion by 2030. Why are sneakers so important? It's just it style. It's a yeah. lifestyle. Sneakers are a lifestyle. And with the lifestyle comes the lingo. Let's start with the basics. Sneakerhead. A sneakerhead is somebody that starts their outfit with what sneakers they're gonna wear. Dead stock. DS or dead stock means brand new. You gotta know what a John is too. And that would be what? That's a person, place, or thing. It's just, it's your John, it's your personality. It's what you like. Or what mom likes, in Nico Tarasi's case. I'm wearing my mom's shoes right now. <laughs> when, I, when I put them on, I'm like, wait, what? I need to like them too because we were wearing the same size. I'm new to the sneaker game, but this touch screen makes it really easy to navigate through the 1300 styles of sneakers inside this boutique. But I'm learning there's another game in town and he's 15. I usually just get pairs and I'll post them on Instagram and I'll have an asking price and I'll tell them to give me an offer. Brayden Zimmerman doesn't even have a driver's license yet, but he's accelerating past most boys his age. He's cashing in thousands of dollars from buying sneakers in store and online and then reselling them. The money per hour I'm making is a lot compared to getting a regular day job. So I could, I probably, I sold these ones in like an hour, made 40 bucks opposed to having a day job making 12 an hour. And he has quite the reputation at school. He knows what's fake, he knows what to get, he knows how to get it, he knows when to get it. He can get you anything really at any time. Can you pick something that you think would work for me? Yeah. Okay, you guys go do that. That's pretty. Yeah, it looks, it's a good shade of orange and I think you would like it. Yes, that's beautiful, thank you so much. Okay, I love it, I love it. You don't really stand out from everybody else, nobody really has you. What do you think of my shoes now? I mean, they're all right. <laughs> we can hook you up some Johns in here, but.